How does a flat earther in full panic mode sound? He sounds like this. Yeah, we don't have any personal <coughs> issue with you. We have an issue with yeah, your of course not. demeaning our argument with statements like you can do fuck all with an angle when you can navigate true statement still in the middle of the same sentence but second mm -hmm. does this scare you not frightened at all maybe you could shut the fuck up while i finish my sentence then. what can you do with Who's an this? Shut angle up. Bitch, shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> Nobody was talking to you. What? You shut the fuck up, Nathan. I'll remove you if you don't shut up while I talk to Bev. You shut the fuck up yourself, cheeky bastard. Right, that bitch is removed from this conversation. Right, Bev. You can measure and find your position on the flat plane with an elevation angle. Yeah, an I mean, angle. Yeah. Yeah. So you can Bev. find your position on the flat plane with an elevation angle, Bev. This is a good. So example, that would be doing Bev. something with an angle, wouldn't it, Bev? Well. Uh, yeah, it would, you stupid fucking retard. So our problem isn't with you personally; it's with you being stupid, not understanding that you can do something with an angle, an elevation angle measure, and can find your position on the flat plane, Bev. You're thick. You don't understand this, and you're attempting to demean our argument with statements of stupidity, like you can do fuck all with an angle. You can do lots with an angle, unless you're a fucking retard, like you. Retard, you can measure your position on Earth with an angle. That means you don't understand the principle of celestial navigation. That's what we were pointing out, Bev. Nothing to do with you personally, where you get your pants in a bunch about you as an individual. Like we give a fuck. I'm not getting my pants like in Like we give a fuck Nathan. about you and your personal problems about how people talk about you. You are a wanker, and we will treat you like a wanker, because that's how wankers get treated. Like wankers, yep. that's what you are. Now, if you want to take it personally, when we're pointing out how you, the wanker, doesn't understand how this argument works, and we'll try and demean it by saying, you can do nothing with angles, when you can find your position on Earth with them and prove they're flat with them, then we're going to point that out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So fuck off back to your stupid, shitty, moron-ridden server so you can tell people like a complete fuckwit that you can do nothing with an angle. While we point out you can find your position on the flat plane with it, Dumbo. Why is Nathan Oakley, he is the idiot shouting and screaming here, in full panic mode? Because Bev try thinking, the self-proclaimed surveyor who refuses to call himself a flat earther because there are mountains and valleys, has said that you can find your latitude by measuring the angle to Polaris, but for the rest you can do fuck all with an angle. And he is absolutely right. Not about the angle to Polaris, of course. Your latitude is the same as the angle to Polaris, but only on a spherical Earth, not on a flat one. That's because there is no linear relation between the elevation angle and the distance to the GP of Polaris on a flat Earth, which in fact determines your latitude. No, he's right when he states that otherwise you can do fuck all with an angle, although that's not the reason he himself thinks he is right. You need to know that his statement was made in a discussion about celestial navigation. Flat earthers still haven't understood that you cannot calculate the distance to the GP of a star when the only thing you have is the angle to the star. And this distance is a prerequisite, or as Oakley consistently would say, a necessary antecedent for you to find your position. And does Oakley oppose Beth's false claim about the angle to Polaris on a flat earth? No, of course not. Oakley opposes Beth's claim that you can do fuck all with an angle. And why is Oakley so triggered? It's because Beth has butchered the whole nonsense that Oakley is spreading about celestial navigation in one single blow. And Oakley knows it. When Wales Welly confirms that Oakley has said that you can determine your position using angles to stars and ask why he hasn't taken the $10,000 challenge by MC Toon, Oakley reacts with his, by now a zillion times copy-pasted, citations that you get an elevation angle from a horizontal plane and therefore the Earth is flat. 
This is of course a non sequitur, as most of his assertions are. It is his only rebuttal to a le legitimate question. In reality, he doesn't take the challenge because he can't. He cannot calculate the distance to the GP, and he has no map on which he could plot the circles of equal altitude. And he knows it. To top it off, he calls upon his acolytes to unsubscribe from Beth's channel. Every time someone strikes his channel with a copyright strike, he whines about him supporting his family and that his income is in jeopardy. But when it suits him, he does just the same on somebody else. And where supporting his family is concerned, with a daily view count of around 1500 on his Nathan Oakley 1980 channel and around 500 on his Nathan Oakley channel, his monthly earnings are around $200. Everything he makes more, he got from begging. You could hardly say he provides for his family. This is why I call Nathan Oakley Nathan Hoaxley. He's not only a bald-faced liar, he also is a snake oil salesman, a beggar, a coward, an uneducated stupido, and a guy with serious anger management problems. And then. I'm being gentle.